some of football's best plays are the worst. And when it comes to bad NFL, nothing is as good as the grand folly of them all. Jim Marshall's wrong way run. Stops, throws, completes it to Kilmer up at the 30-yard line. Kilmer driving for the first down, loses the football. It's picked up by Jim Marshall, who's running the wrong way. Marshall is running the wrong way. And he's running it into the end zone the wrong way. Thinks he's scored a touchdown. He has scored a safety. I know you've been asked about it a bunch. I always like it when people ask me about the six interceptions I threw against the Chargers. <laughs> he throws one deep downfield. It's going to be picked again. That's number six. On that play, Jim, what happened? It's picked up by Jim Marshall, who's running the wrong way. I saw the ball, and the first thing that came in the light down there was a goal post. Ball, goal post. Uh-huh. And, I, and I took off running. And he's running it into the end zone the wrong way. I think it wasn't until I tossed the ball I realized that I had run the wrong way. <laughs> the first player to get to me at the time was Bruce Bosley of the 49ers. And... Uh, he came up and patted me on the back, and I looked around, and the crowd was, I, I've never heard a crowd sound like that. It was sort of a hum or a buzz, like bees. For much of his career, Jim did everything right. Jim Marshall at six feet three and 230 pounds is called the quickest lineman in pro football. A relentless pass rusher, he played 20 seasons, appeared in four Super Bowls, and still holds the Ironman record for consecutive starts by a defensive player with 270. Jim Marshall, the Iron Man. He has started every game the Minnesota Vikings have ever played and established a record of endurance that may never be matched. Dan Orlovsky rolled oh, right and ran out of bounds. That's a safety. How do you run three yards out of the end zone like that and not even know? So you're expecting the best players to always do the best thing every single time. Right. So when they make the mistake, it, it shakes you up, it shocks you, and the shock is where the laughter comes from. Manning stumbles down, the ball came out, Philadelphia ball. You're subverting expectations. You expect a certain thing to happen, and something else happened. Oh, he missed it! That's one of the basic foundations of comedy. Maybe changing the call. Oh, high snap over his head. That's going to be on bloopers. Did y'all make this? Y'all fix this yourselves? Y'all, it's good stuff. The other guys, it's usually going to have the flavor to it. I've done a good job today. You know, one of the things I'm most proud of is that I was able to play my entire 18 year career folly free. You were folly free? I was. Our play fake, Peyton fell down, was going to think about throwing from his seat, decided not to. Never once tripped under center, never cussed hey, out a teammate. Hey, we call the plays, all right? We got to the down there. Let me pop, block, block. Let's look at the tape, Peyton. I'm there. kidding. I'm kidding right now. No, oh, no you did We have tape? All right, I had a foul year two in my career. Not funny at all, by the way, but plenty of follies are. And I wanted to get Keegan's take on the classics. And Pazarczyk fumbles the football and picked up by Herman Edwards. 15, 10. I cannot tell you how many times I've wanted that play to happen to an opposing team <laughs> playing the Lions. Please. I'm like, like, please, a Pazarczyk right now would be great. I don't believe it. I don't believe it. Oh, oh, Daniel. He's gone. Oh, and he looks so good here. Look at he looks awesome. so good here. Trying to stay upright, and he trips. Oh, hey. Oh. <laughs> and he trips. I can say I like know what he's thinking, but I don't. I've never run that far in my life. <laughs> the, the great Dan Marino. The great Dan Marino. Nice throw. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> I like that look right there. Like, right there. I know I shouldn't be doing this. That's right. <laughs> like the jog. The, the little the jog. Little little hip, Enzo. The hip thing. He's Why gonna, is he going this way? I don't know. It's like he wants to pick six. He almost giggled. He almost giggled there. <laughs> OK, this is a classic here. Craig fumbles the snap. There's a scramble for it. Nearly feels it. It's nice. Gets it back. <laughs> and 
throws Amazing. the touchdown. I mean, that's... No, here's the funniest thing in the whole thing. When the Ram comes through, get off of it. <laughs> just, like, what was I going to do? <laughs> that's what gets me is these moments like, get off of it. <laughs> it's good. It's good. Craig gets it back of the 20. Favorite folly of all time? My favorite of all time is Neil Donahue, 1978. Hi, Snap. There's Neil. Hi, Snap. Now, Neil. I was going to I'm, kick. I was going to kick it, but let me see if I can just. <laughs> Why? 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 And then he falls down. <laughs> What's funny is how doggedly he's sticking to his skill set. It's like, I'm not going to pick it up and try to pass it, but I know how to kick. <laughs> it's... Unlike. Gero Upremian yes. in the Super Bowl. In the Super Bowl with Miami. Upremian's attempt will be 34. Here's the snap. The kick is up. Gero. Just fall on it. What is he doing? Don't pick up the ball. Are you trying to throw a ball? <laughs> He's trying to throw it. Trying He's to throw it. He's trying to throw it. He's trying to throw it. The ball is back up in the air. Picked up by the Redskins. Mike Bass down the sideline. And then they top it off. He can yeah. get him right here, but he's going to play the cutback. Oh, man. Damn! First pass of his career, the touchdown for the other team. I mean, anytime a folly has a name. <laughs> yeah, then you know it's like amongst the annals of great follies. <laughs> you gonna bust it. Oh. Cannons, Sanchez gets hit. I forgot that he fumbled for a touchdown. Oh, wow. I did forgot that, too. I have never seen this before in my life. Vince Wilford is going to throw Brandon Moore back into his quarterback. Oh, wow. And it was the backside of Brandon Moore that knocked the ball. It's the same theme of all these. Something bad happens. There's an old saying, don't make chicken salad out of chicken blank, right? Just eat it. Just take it. Just take it. Just fall yeah. out. Yeah, yeah, don't yeah. try to throw it, Garrow. Yeah. Mark, just take the three-yard loss. But his reaction time, I can't believe how fast he decided to run. Into the butt. He rushed it. <laughs> he just, he rushed it. Holy mackerel. I mean, you work extremely hard on comedy. Are you a little bit jealous that a guy like Mark Sanchez can create comedy by running into an offensive lineman's butt? Oh, yeah, it does. It burns me a little bit because that, do you know how choreographed that would have to be if we put that in a movie? <laughs> if we put that in a movie, you'd have to go, uh, OK, guys, here we go again. Take 27. It would take so much timing to make that happen the way that happened in real life. That butt fumble is lightning in a bottle. Right. Lightning in a bottle. I'm not sure if there will be a better, more sublime folly. <laughs> <laughs> that's than that. unbelievable. Oh, that's football follies. 